Jack. There's a statewide APB out on him. Jack's okay. He has something up his sleeve. He's not worried about being caught. How do we help? We go after the other side of the equation. Jack has a lesion and its cronies running scared. We go after the doctor and some of the other guys. But the whole department breathing down our necks. It's time for action, Herschel. It's time for change. Jack's crossed the Rubicon and we have to be on the other side of the Christ, what was that? Explosion. Something big. You think it's the Reds? You think those rusky sons of bitches that dropped the H-bomb on us? Calm down, Herschel. We need to be ready for the call. I'm not waiting for an invitation. Get in the car and head for the cloud. KGPL can give us the details. <laughs> He's like, where am I going? <laughs> no, no, there was, no, they were filling out the tank. Okay. Wait. Wow. That's something. Yeah, we got 44 minutes in. Big Star was a... No, not that. Big the, Star it was H-bomb. Dude, that explosion. <laughs> did, you, did you see that? That was in the shape of a mushroom cloud, dude. I'd be pretty scared, too. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Wowzers. This guy looks like a static, though. Is there a car? Eh, people are riding. No, they're looting. We have looters around the corner. Cut them or put them down. We need to get this area under control. Oh, come on. Don't shoot a cop, you little prick. Let's get that bastard, Paul. Attaboy, right in the ass. Paul oh. Phelps, Panzer. I'm glad you got that done. Jesus. I never seen nothing like this. I wish I could say the same. That was a hell of a bang. The bomb's gone off. Jesus Christ. Poor people. We gotta find out what went down. Delayed, Phelps. Get delayed somewhere? Wasn't nuclear. If it was, we'd all be dead from the radiation. That's reassuring. What's radiation? Everyone inside the factory was vaporized. Look at the size of that crater. What's going on over there? The mayor is going on television, appealing for calm. Television? We can afford one of those things. Anything to go on? We're looking at the remains of Nicholson electroplating. I have an idea of what might have caused the explosion. I'm only guessing. Have a look around the rubble, see if you come up with it. I don't want to use the only machine. Worlds turn upside down. Then it's time for us to do our jobs. You don't? No, I have done it. Hey. Is it one per case or one per desk? How the hell do you have evidence in this place? That's it, Mr. Mayor. We're wrapped. Well, good. Thank you very much. Nice price. You think it went okay? Chief. A couple of pickups, sir, but that's to be expected. Nobody's ever done this before. Get better with practice. We. Oh. The chief of police was here. Oh, oh, size eight. eight. <laughs> this is amazing. That shoe is a perfect condition despite all this. Well, it's clearing up a little. Bit. Jesus. Oh, boy. Imagine the hand twitch. Oh, that'd be scary, man. That's scary. Hey, detective! I think I got something here. He does. The perimeter is up. The whole place is contained. Look to the left. Right there. Hmm. Any idea what this is? Very like large an helmet. A Viking helmet? Power? Looks to me like some kind of machine component. An airplane part, maybe. BMW boss. The nose knows. Did, did a plane crash? I have no idea. Mm, I wouldn't say that. If a plane crashed, we would that would have been very noticeable, wouldn't it? Yeah, we're well, I'm not. I'm not talking about like a commercial jet. But regardless, dude, a plane is not. Oops, there it goes. <laughs> go back to the fork. Look to the right. There you go. This. Yeah, is that a clue? Circumstantial. Oh. Uh. I know there's something Bell. else. I think I found something over here. Hmm. Ipkiss. 
Scroll left what you did. I can see it right there. Superior laundry. It's like another one? Try the laundry pack. It's gotta be more. <laughs> what? Detective, you seen this yet? Come take a look. Blew the locker open, but shielded the contents. Let's see what we got in there. You have a lot. What is this? Spy camera? It's a camera. Spy I want to see camera. that film. <laughs> Only OSS agents use these things. Right. We'll need to get the film developed to see if there's an espionage angle. He probably can naked pictures of himself. Yeah, that or that's the shock. The shock picture of Phelps Any with the camera flash on him. <laughs> None that I care to utter for It's like a Chinese assumption. bell. Pocket, do you have it? I wouldn't say Chinese, I would say Japanese. Japanese, my apologies. Tomoko Akamado. Japanese name. Thank you. Domo Narigato, Mr. Akamoto. What is it? A substitution cipher. The Germans used them in the war. These are cipher rings. You know what to do with them? Maybe. I used them in OCS. So, yeah. This took me a while. First, to do. yeah, I know. This first letter for the cipher. The rest of the message should align itself. H equals K. Yeah. Watch and learn. Okay, so let's go to K. H. H. Now you turn the little dial. The middle one or the small one? The middle one. The little one, small one, yeah. Turn the middle one and you make it out of line to K. You're on no don't dude, you got him aligned. Little little line little circle on K. Little circle. What? Align the H in the K. And the big circle the big circle is H, the little the circle is K. Circle, the inner, oh, okay, inner circle. Okay, okay. Matt, your small circle. No, a little further. Oh. To get to the K. What are you doing, dude? You saw me do that? No. The inner. You see the the one you're spinning right now, right? Yes. Have it so it aligns with so the K is on top. Keep going. Keep going. Stop. Stop. Back. K. Right there. All right. Now what we got there is that. Now you rotate the outer wheel to the first letter of the cycle. So that's our young. Okay. Yeah. S. Okay. K first. N. Next one. S. S. B. B. O. o. J. J. And Vermont. Q. This place was Avenue. Yeah. yeah. X S B. North Vermont F. One three three North Vermont Avenue. Well, this is certainly something. Look at the wire tower. But it's a beautiful day. <laughs> what a fine day for an arson case. <laughs> I love the smell of arson in the morning. Wait. <laughs> I think I can push the camera. I want to push the camera. Can I push the camera? No, I can't push the camera. <laughs> I imagine Phelps actually saying that in his voice. Oh, I can. Just show you somebody you can talk to. He's coming up now. Oh, that's that guy. Okay. Jack Nicholson. Jack Nicholson. No. Fred Nicholson, sorry. I'm Fred oh. Nicholson. Oh! What's <laughs> <laughs> left of it? 32 years of work up in smoke. Can you tell us what happened? Our uh, chief chemist, Harold McClellan, was using this area to test the, the new process. What exactly is this new process? Uh, that's uh, 
classified information, son. A lot of people died here, Mr. Nicholson. I'm prepared to go to the press and tell them it was your fault. What is the new process? A way to chemically polish aluminum. It's traditionally done by hand. It's extremely labor intensive. The process could be worth millions. Who is Tamako Akamato? Dr. McClellan's personal assistant. She came highly recommended. Akamato was involved in industrial espionage. Was she working for you or for a foreign government? That's a ridiculous assertion. How can you possibly say she was a spy? How many of your other employees carry spy cameras in their handbags? Jesus, Mary and Joseph, she was selling me out. If she wasn't a foreign spy, who could she have been working for? There could be other plating companies, but the big customers for the process are the aircraft manufacturers. Lockheed, Boeing, Hughes, North American. What can you tell us about McClellan? A brilliant chemist. He approached me a few months ago with the idea for the new process. So no one has ever done this before? No, but it's legitimate research. So you thought McClellan could do what no one else could do? You were prepared to take that risk? Look, he is a... was a trained chemist. And his ideas could revolutionize electroplating. Mm. And you would be rich. I'm a businessman. What's wrong with turning a buck? You blew up six blocks! God knows how many people are dead. I regret that. That's laudable. We'll be in touch, Mr. Nicholson. Can you send us Dr. McClellan and Miss Akamato's personnel files? I will if I can find them. By the way, we also found the collar of a shirt. It has a laundry tag. They're likely to be Dr. McClellan. Well, the majority of people who worked here don't use a laundry service. So now we gotta go back to Superior Laundry. Phelps, I thought you were under suspension. I got nothing to say to a bum like you. Fuck Damn. you! Draws a fire truck. Okay. Jeez, What's wrong with a good old fashioned black and really white? Of the America La France fire truck. Oh, you need to get their address. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I get a siren! <laughs> I don't know, I moves, rel know. moves relatively fast, too, for a truck. He's still alive. What the hell? <laughs> Turning his shit. You need to get a blue. You need to get to that phone there. Not yet. There's one. <laughs> there yeah. goes one. Oh. Goes. Christ, Elliot. I didn't mean for that! I'm sure you didn't. There's another one. Don't screw it up. Let's kind of stop it. right here. It's top of the middle of the street. Fuck, you're stopping your shit. Elliot? <laughs> Elliot! <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Just tap the gas. Okay, get out. Is Biggs okay with this? Is no. he okay with me driving a fire truck? Oh, no, yeah, sure. Really. What's wrong with driving a good old black and white? Mm -hmm. Detective Phelps, badge 1247. I'm in a fire truck. Fuck you! <laughs> Cole Phelps, fireman. Can you speak to someone at the Army Air Force Base for me, please? Of course, Detective. Tell them I have what I believe is an aircraft part. It's polished metal, light for its size. And it looks like a cone of some sort. It's stamped on the inside. P and W Wasp Major R forty three sixty. Okay. Oh, sorry, I gotta put another, gotta put another quarter. <laughs> that, that was a light change behind you. I need an address for Superior Laundry Services. Closest store to your location is in Wilshire, four seven six six Melrose Avenue. Thanks for your help. Where do you guys want to go? Superior Laundry. Fine. But if the skipper sees us driving around this, we're dead. <laughs> 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 the 
This is so much fun. <laughs> We're going to Superior Laundry. They have hot deals. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Please let's hold on the fire truck, the fire truck is a nice car. I, I, I actually be surprised if the fire truck could probably take a beating. Not really. For the most part. Oh, let's see how this goes. You can't hit you can't hit them with the truck, Elliot. The God knowing that won't stop you from trying, but I took out a mailbox. Don't you feel proud? Several other pedestrians. Kick the can! High stakes edition. Is he driving a fire <laughs> truck? What are you doing, the can can? Yeah. Good. Oh, the guy I see the pun. <laughs> Does no one see this as unorthodox? It's cold Phelps, you just asked that now. Uh, it must be a Wednesday for Phelps. <laughs> <laughs> I actually do want to see him pull, pull up in the fire truck. Hey, what we here? Uh, throwing one of the other cases. Yeah. It was, it's near Chapman's house. It was an homicide. What do you need? Is that your fire truck? Phelps and Biggs, <laughs> LAPD. We have one of your laundry tags. Can you tell us who it might belong to? Are you kidding? I got work to do, Mac. Here's the customer book. Knock yourself out. <laughs> love his love That's his the second ethic. time he said that to us. Love his no, work That's ethic. a different guy. J2620, Oscar Hangstrom. That's Vargas. J. Henry, hey! <laughs> John Henry was a customer here? Three, three jackets and one shirt. No. That happened. Damn. So that went nowhere. For all your help, sir. Let me make a phone call. That ass. That bigs. <laughs> sure, Elliot. Yeah, Elliot, right. Operator, give me our dial. Oh, uh, yeah, it's the same for Jewish guys. Cold Phelps, badge 1247. <laughs> Wait, is he Jewish? Yeah, Herschel's a Jewish. How could I help protect you? He's Jewish. I need an address for an Oscar Hengstrom. Checking. No residential listing for anyone by that name, detective. Sorry. I can't hear That's you. Fine. The phone didn't help us? No, for once, it, for a second time, it didn't help. Like a boss. <laughs> this thing have only radio? place left is the cyber address. And what? Is that a radio? Nope. It does if you turn off the damn siren? Quick, if they had a radio, what song be playing? I don't know. Uh, Ain't no one here but us chickens. Mary had a little lamb. Uh, no, come on, guys, be creative. All yeah. right, Mary had a little toaster. Go for the little go for the fire pot. Oh, okay. Goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Okay, that's one. That song that goes, hot, hot, hot. <laughs> Elliot, you're supposed to be driving toward the flag. I can't help but feel you're going in the wrong direction. Uh, through the fire and flames. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. You're fired, you're fired Gangnam Style by George Jetson. I don't know. <laughs> Over real songs here. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> Sakurai! <laughs> I'm sorry, did he just trip? Yes, he did. <laughs> then they won't know whether to go or stop. No one will know. <laughs> oh! Ooh, I, I just ran someone over. I want to see how long you keep this thing before you lose it. Keep running into things. You're damaging the vehicle. I thought dude, dude, here comes the happy truck. <laughs> oh, boy, the car train, wait, baby! Wait a minute, that's not the ice truck. <laughs> it's Phelps and his murder mobile. <laughs> I can imagine Phelps trying an ice cream truck just to lure him. It's slowing down. It's slowing down. It's oh, it was good while it lasted. At yeah. least it was more visually distinct than any other vehicle you drove so far. Is that a cop car? Yes. Ah, uh, good old black and white. Ah. Uh, fuck it. Taking it. <laughs> Why is it just standing out here like this? That's probably one for a bite to eat. <laughs> Where? Who does? Somebody else's house. Oh, look, there's a dumpster. A dumpster truck. <laughs> Wanna drive it? <laughs> Why not? We dragged on already. Oh, excuse me, right, mister. Fine, fine, I'll go for it. 
bunch of dicks. Oh, hold on, I gotta go the other way. <laughs> oh, it's uh, sorry, it's on the road through the passenger side. <laughs> I need this vehicle. Police business. Thanks, homie. A hello collecto, hell collecto pack. Collect the pack. This guy, this thing has to be a tank. It pretty much is. Yeah. <laughs> it looked like the pole was just dancing. I want to remind the audience that a uh, block was just detonated <laughs> a few minutes ago in a case. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> we. Shit! Yeah. <laughs> this, thing's, uh, this thing's probably a tank. Look at the front! The only thing more powerful than a dumpster truck is the damn. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> damn these white turrets? Oh, wait, why don't you just go through the housing development? You're taking all down. Whoa, 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 what's the the hell? Hell? Go back! <laughs> what? What? <laughs> <laughs> what the? Ellie, get out of the car. We must observe this. <laughs> yeah, we really do. Get out of here. <laughs> How is it doing? <laughs> Cole Phelps. Houdini. <laughs> uh -oh. Oh. I made it reappear. <laughs> he made it reappear. <laughs> oh, he's still in. <laughs> <laughs> he really is a magician. <laughs> the things you can find in this. The things we find in our playthroughs. I never had any of these glitches. I only had not one. <laughs> Did you actually do a dispatch call? No. This is there. Oh. <laughs> so what is the carpet taking that? <laughs> Look at the front, though. It's like... It's, well, the it, front shit, but, you know, still, you're in a garbage truck. Toot toot. <laughs> this is like 15 minutes alone, ain't it? <laughs> uh, ooh, that was close. Ah! No! <laughs> the <garbage laughs> yes, the garbage man. Why Never ride that, a garbage. Why sound familiar? I might have heard it somewhere before. Why does that sound familiar? Song. John, why does that sound familiar? What was that from? My yeah. lips are sealed. Oh, you, you assholes! <laughs> this from you? <laughs> Apartment one. Well, well. Why the cloak and dagger routine, Miss Akamato? If that is your real name. <laughs> That's convenient. Oh. What the? What is this? Oh god! I knew it. Ooh. She murdered her strange you father. Think I, I guess. Fit in there? I couldn't fit in there. <laughs> I'd like to think you would have had something more to say about getting shoved in a fridge, Herschel. <laughs> Look at his eyes, Herschel. Johnny, did you see his eyes? Yeah. One of the head, one of the heart. Point blank. John Doe. We don't know his name. That's his name. No. I mean, that's not what's his name. <laughs> his name is John Doe. That's the name of Stiff Elliot. <laughs> Wait a minute. Uh, actually, it means an identified person, really. Not just a stiff. No, it's a stiff. You give. Well, an unidentified man, yeah, you'd name John Doe, but it's usually another, another term for a stiff. No, oh, that's an unidentified, unidentified corpse. You, you thought the guy's name was John Doe earlier? Yeah. <laughs> Very expensive watch. Taken by Flyboys. I always wanted one as a kid. That's funny. Well, I don't as think a he's going to miss it. was some food on the table. Herschel grew up during the Great Depression. Ugh. Oh, I'd imagine he would. That sucks. Phelps is most likely... Wait, this is 47, right? Yes. Phelps is 27, oh, roughly. Wait. He grew up in the turbulent 20s. But he was a kid when the Great Depression happened, so... Well, I would say nearing the end. Wow. Well, the Great Depression was 1929, 1930. Oh, oops. Yeah. Oof. It looks like he was shot and dragged. 
into a refrigerator into a refrigerator, I guess. What is that? A matching set? Looks like we have a match. Second half of the Potara fusion rings. Huh. Interesting game, this Akamoto. What is that? What the hell is that a transmitter? Microfilm. What is oh, that? Hmm. Microfilm. A document. What is it? It's the size of your thumbnail. <laughs> Rod must have a mate, and I said. Yeah. He decides to leave it there. What's not his? Pain. Brush. Oh, brush. Don't care about brush. It's gotta be a little bit more. Are you cold? <laughs> what is that? What? There's a cop. You know what this is, Biggs? Sure. The department gives you one of those when you retire. Speaking of which, why haven't I yet? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Biggs, Edge 525. That's what I was going to say, Biggs, Batch 1. Skeletons in the Avenue, Wilshire. We'll need an ambulance in the corner. Okay, I'll just wait Probably until he's done here. Technical services as well. Hurry up, Biggs. Thank you, Biggs. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Detective Phelps, batch 1247, messages please. You need to call Ray Pinker urgently. Can you put me through? It's ringing now. We're on our way in. Nick's that. I got a message from Lindbergh Field. An airplane tech there identified your part. What is it? He said it was a prop spinner from either a Corsair or a B-50. A what? Fits over the center of the propeller and protects the pitch gearing. So it's a military part? Could be, but get this. The Spruce Goose runs eight Wasp R-4360s. I think you better get over there and check it out. We're on it. No, way, that's the Spruce Goose. <laughs> I thought it was a liquor. Uh, I, I hear Spruce Goose, and the, the Spruce Goose is the name of the little aircraft that Mr. Burns made when he was a. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take the Spruce Moose. Hop in. <laughs> we'll take the Spruce Moose, and we'll be on the I'm on a roll again. <laughs> I'll let you know. The garbage truck is set as my car. How are we gonna look getting around in this thing? <laughs> like a boss. I'm in the dumps. 